The main entrance of Bilima Oil Producing Limited in Port Harcourt is being blocked here by aggrieved staff for non-payment of their salaries and benefits. The staff informed journalists during a protest that for some years now, they have been marginalized by the company's management. The workers who had placards with different inscriptions like pay our COVID allowance, we say no to non-payment of two months salary, among others, say they understand that they have been issues in some of the company's locations, but that they have also exercised patience with the management. They say since the company is still in operation with work ongoing, the management should pay them their money. We have been saying a lot, we have engaged our management. In fact, it was like a slave. So what we want to say to our management is that we know that since inception, few of our location is down. And we have been working with the zone, zona executive council, to make sure that at least we go back to operation. But up to now, no effort has been made from the management side. If you talk, you are sacked. Anybody who makes noise concerning welfare, you are sacked, you have been removed. That is the problem we have with our management. So, we want them to sign our CBA for crying out loud, collective bargaining agreement. They should sign it and implement it. For more than seven years, we don't have any condition of service. In fact, since the inception of Belema Oil Producing Limited, our salary structure, since we started working here, they've not promoted us, no promotion, no salary structure, nothing. Our pension, uh, um, for more than two years, they are um, deducting our pension from our salaries, but they are not remitting it to our pension providers. Pangerson also joined the protesters, calling on Belema Oil to reduce funds for the workers. The protesters also want the company's management to sign and implement a collective bargaining agreement. Belema must come to the table and we are not going to leave this place until we get everything that our members are supposed to get. Let me also send it to Belema and his, exec and his members and his parliament. Pengasan, this is just the beginning and we are taking it lightly because at the end of the day, we will start seeing other members of other branch coming here to enforce it. We are the one taking care of the children at home when the husbands are at the field. Right now, my husband has been at work in that platform precisely for 51 days without lights we communicate every day no water to bait no good water like they are baiting salt water from the sea oh it's horrible from my own personal experience my children could not write their exam because we could not pay their school fees arise news reached out to the manager of public affairs and community relations at belema oil producing limited samuel abel jumbo he promised to speak on the issue, but is yet to do so.